And welcome to ETF Edge, your go-to place for everything ETFs. I'm your host, Bob Pisani. Gold is busting out. ETF trading remains robust. And despite everybody working from home, business is really good for the ETF business overall. Active management is also catching a bit on top of that. We've got a lot to talk about. We have three of the best in the business with us. Reggie Brown from GTS. Renato Leggy from ARK Invest and Harry Witten from Old Mission Capital as well. Reggie, let me start with you. Gold's hitting all-time highs. Silver's hitting new highs as well. Big inflows into those large gold ETFs, even the stock uh, ETFs around gold uh, and silver. What's driving the interest? Is this just a, a weak dollar story? Is it a sluggish growth story? Is it an inflation worry story? Is it all of the above? What, what's moving gold so much in the last month? Uh, hey, Bob. Thanks for having me on again. I think it's all the above plus an additional one. So we heard earlier uh, one of your panelists say that the dollar is hitting a two-year low. Um, that means that the real interest rates are, are plummeting and there's no risk for, uh, for, uh, for interest rate risk. And I think uh, with the central banks around the world, you know, with quantitative easing and, and printing of, of new currency to support some of the coronavirus rescue measures, um, you know, the, you know, I think we're seeing weak currencies across the board. But look, I, I think the, the biggest story here, I think uh, you're seeing greater adoption of commodities, and particularly gold and silver, being put into asset allocation models. And I think that's, you know, a, a new trend that we're seeing that's driving also the price of gold. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Harry, you, you see a lot of trading. You you uh, specialize in trading and the. Uh... Uh, being a broker in the ETF business here, uh, even silver's rallying, the gold stocks rallying uh, as well. I know silver has, you know, components of both industrial and a precious metal. Precious metal, not exactly the same dynamics of gold, but very, very similar. Um, uh, can you explain precious metals as well as silver for the same dynamics as gold? Yeah, I mean, it's you look at the metals that it's just been in the last, specifically silver, the last couple of weeks, uh, been going up to, um, you know non-stop uh, creation units in the in the ETFs, record volumes. Um, I'm not sure if you saw this, Bob, but just last week, gold, GLD, IAU, and then SLV Silver uh, were three of the top five for inflows out of all ETFs in the industry. So it's uh, being looked at by yeah. a lot of people. Um, and there's more opportunity, uh, people think, in silver. They think gold has run up a little bit higher. It's hitting all-time numbers where silver is, is still way off its all-time high. Uh, so I think people think it has more room to run.